Hello everybody, this is Deb from Just Do Something Homestead and I did an impromptu stop into Wise Markets and look for red tags and wow, was this the day to shop. I made a quick run to Wise Markets, actually just to grab a couple things and what I discovered is they had hundreds, and I mean hundreds, of red tag specials. And so I saved so much money, and I wanna go over some of these with you today. I have just started shopping at Wise, and I am finding so many sales. They have racks and racks of discounted items towards the back of the store, and I hadn't seen this before. But there are many things on here, including some organic things. Wise Market is a store that is nearby. I think they're mainly based out of Pennsylvania. This one was actually in Maryland. Um, some people say why, some say Weiss, and some say we is. <laughs> Either way, it is one of the stores. I don't frequently shop there because their regular prices are pretty high, but they are extremely good at marking them down before they are expired. Typically, I do not see any clearance items in the regular shelves. They're bright red stickers. Uh, they tend to be in the clearance section around the outside of the store. So I hit the outside of the store and look for the red tags. When you go to Wise Markets, you're going to want to look for these dark red tickets. I call them the red tag deals. And what they are is marked down foods. Now, when we talk about meats, I'm usually pretty leery about buying marked down meats. I am not leery at Wise Markets. It's not like shopping at, say, Walmart where, oh, it's gray. I don't think anybody's going to buy it. Let's mark it down a dollar. No, they mark theirs down 50% before it expires. Now, these are saying they expire tomorrow. Now, for me... I just came home and I threw them in my refrigerator immediately while I unloaded my car. Now tonight, I will freeze them all. All right, I am going to start with the items that need to be put in the refrigerator or the freezer. And so that leads me to start with the meats. And so I was able to find Purdue chicken thighs. Look at that price. $2.17, $2, that is just mind boggling. And so, oops, that one's upside down. So I was able to get two packages of these. Summer is coming, we like to grill these. And this one was $2.24, so wow. This package has four pieces in it, it is two pounds. And so that will be two meals for us at $1.12 a meal. Next is boneless, skinless chicken thighs. We also use quite a few of these. This is a little more expensive. It's $3.61. I, I am just overwhelmed. This one has, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, maybe eight pieces in it. So we're talking quite a few meals out of that. And the one thing I like is they're by nature, all natural, locally raised, cage free. Um, no antibiotics. So I typically, if I'm purchasing meat, that is the brand that I would go with. So I am going to go stick these in the refrigerator so I can divide them tonight and freeze them. I've never purchased their Wise to go, but they are on sale for $4.90. I might give it a try. These next two, I have never actually looked into that refrigerator. Uh, they're called Wise to go and they are pre-made meals that you just heat up. And so normally they are $7. These were marked down to $4.99. And I was looking at them thinking, well, I really don't need them. And then I thought, you know what? It is almost hay season. And so these are gonna make a fantastic quick meal. So I bought four of them, two for me, two for Jim, and I'm going to freeze them and just pull them out and heat them up for a quick meal. My goodness, they're hams are half off. And when I start looking at the price of these, oh, upside down, $7.60 for that one. This is a steal and I am going to freeze them. I have one last item and that was a ham. And actually I was standing there looking at the chicken prices, which was pretty amazing. And an employee came up and said, you might be interested in one of these hams. 
and I looked and there was a whole bin of hams. And let's look at the price here. It says <laughs> that it's on sale. First off, you have to look at the main price. It says it was $30.80. Okay, well, I'm not going to be buying that. Um, and then it says that it's on sale for $17.57. That's still a little more than I want to pay. And then I saw the red tag. Let's look. $8.78. So that is amazing. It was $30.80. So this expires on June 25th. We have plenty of time but I am going to throw this into the freezer. The first opportunity, we have a couple of the kids come home. I'm gonna yank it on out. Now, I am a frequent fryer when it comes to the bakery section at finding the good deals. Mm -mm -mm -mm. These chocolate cake with peanut butter icing is truly to die for. Hmm, again, any of these that are on sale can be frozen. That way, you can pull something out for a quick dessert. We have a lot of pretzels on sale. Chocolate covered pretzels. This one might be hard to see, but it is a chocolate chip cheesecake and there are two slices in there. And uh, on a previous video, I mentioned that it is my birthday tomorrow and it is also our anniversary. So Jim and I are going to celebrate with a piece of cheesecake. Let's see, there's the red tag marked down to $3.30. It was $5.50. And shh, don't tell anybody. But tomorrow, since it's my birthday, I had decided I wanted to bring in a few treats. So I will be taking these brownies to work. And they were on sale for $3.60 from $6. Next, I'm on to orange juice, and I've got to tell you, it's been a very long time since I've had orange juice because it's expensive, and so we drink a lot of water, so I was very excited to find this. $1.99. It was $3.99, so it's not going to last long. I don't have to worry about that expiring. And talking expiration date, this one says it is May 28th, which is in four days, as we know, that is not an expiration date. That is a best buy date. If you take care of this, put it in your refrigerator immediately, you can gain more time and it will be fine. I found a few yogurts. Actually, there was a ton of yogurt on sale, but we can't eat that much yogurt. <laughs> Um, this one is one of Jim's favorite. It's one of those that you flip over and it has crumb topping. Um, but this was Key Lime Crumble and it was on sale for $2.99. It had been $5.99. And then over here, this is his absolute favorite brand of yogurt. They were 83 cents. And let me tell you, these are now $1.99 in the store. That just blows my mind. So we have eaten these significantly past the Best Buy date, and they have been fine. I'm not sure I can see what this one says. Oops, upside down. It even says Best Buy. Best Buy May 26th. Trust me, you can add at least a month to that. I rushed through those so I could get them either in the freezer or the refrigerator. So we are now moving on to the shelf stable items. Um, actually, this one right here is tortillas. And so, whoops, I could keep turning them upside down. $1.24, it is half price. So they are not expired. And Jim actually loves these. So I think he's going to be pretty excited. We cannot have enough snack foods in this house because we're always on the go. I'm regretting that I only bought two boxes of these. They were $1.50. And the best buy date of those granola bars is June 2023. I will be following up this video with another one on vacuum sealing these to get that date extended at least another year. I have not heard of Steve and Andy's organic cookies, but wow, coconut oatmeal sounds pretty good to me. So $2.94, they were a little pricey, but... I'm always looking for more organic foods to have on hand. 
Now, Annie's I have heard of for many years. We've enjoyed these foods. This one is organic Bernie's Farm fruit snacks. Basically, it is fruit snacks. <laughs> so these were $2.19. There are five packs in there. And yes, even as adults, I love fruit snacks. Coffee. This one had been $10.99 on sale for $5.49, but I was looking at it. And it says notes of toasted malt and milk chocolate. Ooh, blonde roast. Uh, that's sounding pretty good to me. And I will start using this tomorrow for breakfast. It expires June 17th, 2023. Oh, pardon me. Doesn't expire. It's best before. Organic cereal. I will mix this in with my magic mixture of organic cereals. It was $2.84. Ooh, and I love peanut butter. Ooh, close to expiration, which is best before June 12th. Oh, please, oh, please don't shame me. Uh, when I was a child, my mother refused to buy these for me. <laughs> so as an adult, this is one of those things. I just love the cereal. So it was $3.09. And look at that date. Oops, it's hard to get in focus. That is January 21st, 2024. I have plenty of time to eat these. I threw these cake mixes in there. They are actually not a red sticker deal. These are just on sale. They were $1.79 each, but if you bought three, they came down to 99 cents. And I am going to be doing a video very soon on vacuum sealing your, your baked things that are already boxed. So it's a little bit different on how to do it, but I thought I'm going to grab them now when it's such a good price. And the last few things are health and beauty. So I do use this allergy spray and wow, $5. So that's a, that's a great one. So I was excited to find that. Shh, don't tell anybody. But I color my hair with 6.5G. Mm-hmm. And this one was on sale for $4.24. You can't find it for less than $7 anymore. It says the retail price was $8.49. Homesteading is hard work. I need a powerful clinical strength deodorant. And, oh, I love this one. This one is secret. And so this came down to $4.74. It had been $9.49. Things like that. I don't know why they mark it down. It's not going to expire. And the last item I was able to get today with the red tag sale was dental floss. This one has me pretty excited. Um, I was able to get three of them. They were 89 cents. Again, when is your dental floss ever going to expire? So, and this is a good one. So I was pretty excited. It, normally it says it's $1.79. And oh my goodness, I almost forgot to tell you about this. This is my favorite ice cream. It is tea berry and Wise Markets is the only place I can find it. I have their Shoppers Club, and when you spend $100, you get a free container of ice cream. And so on top of all that today, I got free ice cream. So there you have it. That was today's haul at Wise Markets. If you have a Wise Market, definitely be on the lookout for those red tags. They are almost exclusively on the perimeter of the store. So in the refrigerated section, um, there's huge shelves in the very back. Uh, it looks like you're going to the restrooms and it's actually like this little hallway full of items on sale. Bakery items, dairy items, uh, and definitely meats. So if you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and share. And you know what? Have a blessed day. Bye-bye, everybody.